G'day and welcome. Today I want to talk about roof rack holders and more specifically roof rack holders for shovels. Now most of you who've got a rhino rack are probably very familiar with this type of mount. It's a screw mount, screws in, screws out. It's currently what I use to hold my shovel on the roof rack. Um, but the biggest problem with this one is it takes forever to do. You're always knocking your knuckles about and anything that takes a long time to do generally means you're not going to use it. I know there are times when I should have been using my shovel perhaps to move some dirt, do a bit of road building where I've avoided it because it's just such a pain to get the shovel off. Anyway, a mate of mine came up with a solution. He suggested, it's a different brand for me and I hope I'm pronouncing this right, it's called Yakima and it's the Yakima Ace of Spades shovel holder and it's got a very very interesting way of, of grabbing the shovel. And it's a clasp, I guess you call it a clasp type mount. So we've got, uh, yep, some destructions, a couple of mounts. Now, in showing you what I'm talking about is this here. So you can imagine that's clasped down on your roof rack. Push this down, clasp it on. Take it off. Super easy. Um, that's the whole reason I've got these to try out. I'm going to try them out on the trip up to the Cape I'm about to do. Um, now I did notice they've actually come with a key. That's a bit of a little bonus. Um, looking at the fitting gear for them. I mean, wow. Actually these things, I think they're going to fit perfect for, perfect for Rhino. Just give me a sec. got a pack of rhino nuts here these are their channel nuts and we'll just we'll just compare them um, they are going to be perfect for the rhino channels so I don't envisage there being any problems fitting this up um, comes with a couple of different lengths of screw uh, I guess that's for your different different channels I'm assuming that they actually were thinking about putting this on Rhino when they came out with it. The keys, a couple of different types of mount and them. Uh, kind of cool, I notice. I mean, it gives kudos to any company that has a bit of fun with their marketing. Uh, on the side here, it's got your D shovel handles, your long handed shovels, paddles, axes, and down the bottom here it says even battle axes. Well, anything that can say even battle axes. Uh, I guess um, we should try that out. We'll head out now to, to Scooby and the roof rack and we will see if we can fit the battle axe onto the roof rack. Hi, okay, so we're out here uh, looking at the Rhino rack on the top of Scooby, which is my 79 series. It's got the battle axe. Um, you can probably see here, I've got the Rhino shovel. It's held on by the, the, the screws. Um, Drives me to tears trying to climb up and take that off. Um, so we've got the Yakima Battle Axe Mounts. I'm going to call them the Battle Axe Mounts. Um, which has got a, quick, a very quick clasp connection. Uh, and we're going to see how they go for attachment. I mean, they're a, they're a perfect fit in here on the, the Rhino Rack. Um, using the Allen key which actually was provided, which is kind of nice. Free. Easy to put that on. Put the other one on. Put the battle axe in. You know what? That's actually really good. Um, no, no, this is sideways. Uh, but in looking at the the way the Rhino ones fit on the on the Rhino rack, I actually think I'm going to be able to to take them off, and um, I'm going to fit these mounts up directly directly there to replace that. And I'm actually thinking um, now. I got these from 
from Anaconda. They've got an eBay shop, uh, which I just bought directly, posted straight to home. I'm going to say I think it was $68 and 50 bucks for postage. I'm going to get another set. I mean, I don't... I was going to wait until I, I do the trip to the Cape, but uh, having seen how well that mounts up and... I mean... How quick and easy is that? I mean, if you want to... If we want to wage Viking war, um, you're going to be able to, to do that extremely quickly. Damn, that's, that's actually really good. Um, thumbs up for me on, on that for the Yakima battle axe holders. Um, cheers guys, I'll uh, report back long term on how they get on once we've had them on here for about 12 months.